Hello, in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you multiple methods on how you can fix PC streaming could not access the specified channel error. Now, I'm going to be showing you step by step on how you can fix this problem. Firstly, start with like basic things. You just need to go to file in the top left and then click on settings. And then after that, you want to click on stream and then make sure you relink your Twitch or whatever you are stri streaming on. Just relink it, reconnect it, okay? Remove it and connect it again and see if it works. Also, make sure you use the exact, like, if you are you like if you are using the stream key here, make sure it's the same, okay? Make sure it's correct, okay? You can also connect account. It's recommended if you are using stream key, stream key, just click on connect account. It's recommended, okay? Just get the stream key and then make sure it's correct. And after that, you want to click on apply, click on okay. Okay, so next step is make sure you are not using any VPN inside your laptop. Like if you recently downloaded any extension, this might cause this problem. So make sure you remove it and see if the problem is solved or not. Now, there are multiple reasons why this happens. Like, for example, the stream key or the server's server uh, URL is incorrect. The target PC streaming PC, uh, like the server is not reachable. The firewall or network blocks OBS from sending data. So by the way, whenever you open OBS, make sure you click on, you right click, and then make sure you click on run as administrator. Okay, just so that you can use all the, the, the settings so that you can use your OBS without any problem. As you can see here, it says here firewall or network blocks OBS from sending data. So what you need to do is you wanna search here for firewall and network protection in your windows and then make sure you disable it here it says private network click on it and then you want to uncheck this okay just uncheck and then click on yes and then try if it works if it doesn't work please come back and then enable it because it doesn't do anything in this case so if it does if it if it does work that's fine if it doesn't work come back to the same settings click on firewall then click on enable toggle it on and then go back now another way so if it works when you turn off the firewall like uh, or fire like here as you can see firewall and network protection it, if, it, if it, when you turn it off if it does work then what you need to do is you want to come back and then turn it on okay and then you want to search for windows defender um then the uh, fender firewall now after that you want to come here and then after that, you want to click on allow an app or feature through Windows uh, Defender Firewall. And after that, you want to find here um, OBS. Okay, try to find it here. Just search for it. And then, okay, you're going to keep searching for OBS. Just click here on change settings. And then you want to find here OBS. Now, after you find it, what you need to do is you want to toggle it on, okay? Just here, click on public. You want to click on, just check this, okay? You can also click on add, add another app, and then click on browse, and then you'll go back to the obvious, click on this PC, find the, the program, click on this, and then click on program files, and then you want to find here obvious. So after you find obvious, then you want to add it here. Okay, that's all you need to do. Now, if you cannot find it, just find it here, try to find it here. If you cannot find it, then what you need to do, let me check. If you, like if this doesn't work, you wanna click go back, okay? And then here is what you need to do, okay? Just go back, search for Windows. This is the last step and this, I hope this will work. Windows. Um, Windows, and then and then search Windows Defender Firewall. Okay, Windows Defender Firewall. Search for it. Here is how it looks like. Click on it, and then you want to click on Advanced Settings. Then click on Inbound Rules. Find here the obvious. Just try to find it here. I'm going to do that right now. Just uh, find it. Okay. 
or you can just do this okay it's very simple that anything that's not enabled you want to enable it now all these are green 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 these two are not enabled so right click then click on properties and then make sure you allow connection i'm not telling you to allow connection for everything only obvious if you see here obvious and next to it there is this red mark here that means it's not enabled so just click right click on obvious if it's not enabled of course but if it's all green here and these things are not related to obvious just leave them don't click on it now for example if these two are obvious right click click on properties and then click on allow connection click on apply okay if you can find like anything that says that you want to find it right click on it and then click on allow connection if it's related to obvious okay so hopefully this tutorial helped if you have any questions let me know in the comments i reply to every single comment let me know in the comments what problem you have i try to reply to everyone see you in the next tutorial